Don't go to the death house for selling dope or stealing cars. If you can break into the house of an 87 year old widow woman and you can beat her and you can rape her, steal everything she's got and because she's reluctant to give you the wedding ring that hasn't left her hand in 65 years, you put a pistol right here and blow her head off. If you can commit that kind of crime, you deserve the death penalty, and I have no problem at all executing anybody who would commit that kind of crime. And those are the people who you deal with in the death house. And when you think about that incident, how does it, how does it make you feel? It makes me feel like I should have killed her. She's such a pain in the ass. We're Texas, and if you get the death penalty, well, by God, you're gonna die. And I think the court records show that there were five shots fired within 40 seconds. So that's one shot, what, every eight seconds. Can you tell me what happened or why your dad ended up in prison? My dad killed five people. This story is told from the point of view of the children, which I don't really think you never hear, what about the kids? I mean, don't be afraid of violence. It's good for you. I mean, there's three things that make our existence, right? Art, fucking, and killing. So, art, fuck, kill.